Sell versus the Triller, share <laughs> equity with performers. Did they sell it or not? Who, who's publishing this? Pitchfork? Yeah. What the fuck does Pitchfork know? How do they know if they sold it? Uh, Because they have PR people that send them press releases no. to all the outlets. Let me read what uh, <laughs> let me read what uh, Pitchfork has to say. Swiss Beats and Timberlands versus has been acquired by Triller Network. Acquired. Stop right there. What does acquired me? Did they buy it or not? I'm not a call Swiss. I'm not a <laughs> what is acquired? I, yeah, I hate the word acquired. Up. And we're stupid. Hold up. Buddy. It's right there. The I got you. Acquired. Buy or obtain an asset or an object for oneself. Yo, I managed to acquire all books needed. My bad. I thought he was putting all four awards up here. Man. <laughs> I mean, oh, no. all right, cool. yeah, ego. It's cool. Just, just your award. <laughs> Yo, but they are killing me for having an ego. <laughs> Yo, having an ego is bad, Mo. Yes, your ego is horrible. Everybody has an ego, but it's, it's don't it's, everybody have an ego? Of course, it's weird. No, it's it's weird in how you display your it's ego. It's important to have somewhat of an ego. CNS back to podcaster Grace, like yeah, it's 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 how and where you, you yours is just if a little they excessive. get to see every, no, it's because we got to do this fucking thing twice a week where they get to oh. talk to me. I'm mad quiet at home, yeah, and you wonder why I'm not fucking passionate about it anymore. I'm mad fucking <laughs> quiet and humble at home. <laughs> I don't think ego is a bad thing. That's all. No, ego, I, don't ego, out, I don't think I'm out of control with my ego. Ego, ego channeled right is perfect. Sure. Yeah, I don't think it's. it's Look at mine out too. So you don't, you don't feel so. Yeah, come on, man. We we got four of these. Yeah. They didn't send us one. Yeah. To split up. We got four of them. That shit about as heavy as a real yeah. fucking turntable. Not not only is it heavy, put them up there so they know the vibes. Listen, yeah. they didn't oh, just send the grand. The audience, the audience that's not dissing me for having ego. They travel with us. None of this is possible without y'all. This is you guys' award, not ours. True. Um, thank you. We love you. We appreciate you. Jokes aside, seriously. Yeah, no, 1,000 yeah, is it. 1,000 is it. They ain't giving us another one. <laughs> now, hey, Never going to have it. Enjoy your little hashtag award. Yeah. <laughs> enjoy yeah. your little microphone. A little turntable shit. You did. <laughs> Y'all know we're not getting another award. You can't, nah. you can't body the awards for a couple years and then get more. Yeah, we gonna, they nah. have to pick other people. Oh, we didn't nah. talk about the Ambies. We'll get to that later. Unless we sign to iHeart and then iHeart does their awards where they just award themselves. We won't get one. Well, we're not signing our. Oh, that's a that, big fact. That, that that is not happening. Acquired means it's or, theirs. If I acquire this shirt from you, this is my shirt. You can never do that though. <laughs> <laughs> but if I did, I would have ownership of the shirt. Mad yeah. hi, mad hypothetical. That is, though. Yes, Roy. I, I can never take the shirt off of you. No, your his vintage four forty four shirt. It's too tight. Is it vintage? <laughs> I, I can't pull it, looks it off. Vintage. Him. You washed it. You the album came out three years. Three years ago. Is it vintage? Yeah, you should, you should, and you she NFT it. Look she NFT it. Look at him fucking. That's a good idea. <laughs> nah, NFT. I'm, not, yeah, I'm, NF, that, I'm numbers, NFT in my award. Watch the numbers jump. <laughs> watch the numbers. 300K, easy. What do you mean? <laughs> Listen. <laughs> if Azealia's selling moan videos, I could sell my 444 yeah, team. She sold an audio sex tape for Wait, $300 billion. Dollars. Excuse me? Yeah. Wait, who did what? Azealia, friend of the show. Mm -hmm. One of our biggest supporters. Friend to you and more. Well, she loves us. She uh, sold her audio sex tape to NFT and Parks. The numbers you were breaking down were what exactly? Uh, I think the original sale was like fifteen thousand dollars. Regular, yeah. nice, you know, cool. regular yeah. shit though. But then it's now reselling for a hundred and fifty thousand ETH, which mm -hmm. translates to uh, three hundred billion dollars. <laughs> it was something along those lines. Yeah, she yeah. sold her audio sex tape for three hundred billion. Regular. All right, round of applause. And Lakeith, so, was, yeah, on, gotta, so Lakeith yeah, was on Clubhouse so. moaning for free. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, Mo, Lakeith said that was a recording. I don't care what he said, man. <laughs> he did said that wasn't he was, him. He was moaning. Okay. He could have got some ETH. Here's Congratulations. The, here's the thing Zillia. with that excuse, Lakeith. It's even weirder that you have a recording of a moan. Yeah. Like, <laughs> no, it's so funny. He went to YouTube and typed it in. You're equally as weird yeah, for still, going to YouTube. Same weird. <laughs> I've never typed moans moaning. on YouTube. <laughs> moaning. No, I understand what y'all saying. Y'all think y'all get more bitches than him? 
I don't know how many. Women. I mean, I'm asking. Look, I don't know. Look, how, look, 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 look. I don't know how many look, women that man interviewed. Now, now it's chuckles, and I, I don't, don't know. know how many women that man interviewed. I mean, but let's guess. I don't know. I mean, let's guess. You think you think you do more numbers than him? Um, I do not look at women as numbers nah, as data. I, I look agree. at women as you know beautiful creatures that nah. we yeah. cannot live on this earth without. Yeah, you can't fuck with the key. I just yeah. appreciate my inner circle. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but you can't yeah. fuck with him. <laughs> so you hey. can't fuck with him is what you say. All that shit is sweet. <laughs> so so you can't fuck with him, right? <laughs> got it, got it. Hey, listen, man, we all gotta come to grips. There's some yeah. niggas we can't fuck with. I checked the new Michael B. Jordan trailer for the movie. I'm watching it. I'm I can't uh, add every. I can't escape that ad, and I don't really know why. But it looks like a good movie. Sure. It does. I'm, he ain't I'm say, just mad because I've seen it too many times. He didn't say three words in the trailer, but I'm still watching it. <laughs> it looks good. What it's, is it? It's uh, uh, yeah, remo- uh, without remorse. This is the one. That's the picture that's always it's on my Twitter everywhere. and yeah. Reddit and everywhere. No, nah, it does look good. It looks like a good movie. Yeah, I'm going to watch that movie. It looks Mo- like, uh, what's uh, Matt Damon? Uh, what's the Matt? What's, what's the I don't know nothing about his Matt His biggest Damon. movie. I don't know. I don't even watch this shit. I know you're talking about Bourne's is his name is it Matt oh yeah Bourne Jason Bourne Bourne. Jason Bourne that's what this looks like Black Jason Bourne Jason Bourne who wins Jason Bourne or John Wick Jason Bourne will beat the dog shit out of John Wick (laughs) did you see the last John Wick three yes yeah terrible movie you think Jason Bourne will beat the shit out of John Wick Jason Bourne beat a nigga with a book he killed a nigga with a book (laughs) yeah Jason Bourne might be Top a three book. in movie characters. I've never, that'll I've kill never you. seen nothing like that. He runs with a lot. the book. He does a lot. Him, of running. Uh, Mark Wahlberg, and Most shooters of that up movie there. Is him running through streets of Europe <laughs> and diving through windows. <laughs> Dude's endurance is high. Jason Bourne will <laughs> kill. <laughs> How you Jason sprint for three miles? <laughs> he would laugh at John Wick if John Wick tried to square. Like you should leave now. <laughs> you should leave. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Just yo, if me. if you saw your queen out with with Lakeith, you go up there and say, "Yo, she with me." Nah. <laughs> you don't no. you know what time it is with Lakeith? Just count your losses. That's Do it. it. <laughs> count your losses. Just get on the phone and, and now just, I could flirt free. No, just walk out and remember where you parked at. Yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> Tell him pull it pull it right up. <laughs> Text her, hey, your jacket's in the car, just yeah. let me know when you want it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's niggas that be doing shit like that. <laughs> Are you coming to get your body wash? Man, no. you don't throw that shit in the garbage. No, man. it's me. I'm right here. <laughs> Are you coming to get your body wash? It's just sitting here. <laughs> I don't like having these. Th- Wait, did we finish talking about whatever we supposed to be talking about? Yeah, but I wanted to see. No, no, we, we're no we were talking about versus. versus. You, you were like, calling oh. Swiss. Oh, we're, oh, yeah, that's what I was doing. <laughs> so what was he talking about? Y'all think Swiss going to talk about his business dealings with us? No. Nah, this is what I think, since you asked. Okay. I'm or he'll do a really good PR I way. think that yeah. Joe is so real of a nigga. That when I dial up the ego, back to ego. Goddamn, I'm not disproving any of this ego stuff. I have an ego though. We know. No one is denying that. You do too. Of course I do. And you do. Of course. And you do. We're fucking men. Men, and you do. men have, we real, have that. real men have egos. Everybody on the planet I, I has an ego. I put it in a song. I told her I have an ego. I'm a fuck bitches. <laughs> Everybody on the but I said it, that again, in a record. It's how and when you display your ego. That's all. Hey, Everybody if you ego. can't deal with what we go through, us, that means I want to deal with it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> then I have bitches lined up because yeah. I have an ego too, and egos need to be fed. That's true. What was I talking about? You're going to call Swiss still. <laughs> oh, yeah. This is what I think. I think I'm such a real ass nigga that when I get people on the horn, it's official. It's situated already. Mm. Everything is handled. So Not like when Rory first. called Ari Lennox. Mm. This is when when I make the call. Yeah, it's different. Okay, it's different. You okay. ain't got to worry about. We can air it. Oh no, we can, <laughs> hey, when Joe made the call, we can air this. <laughs> yeah, no, nah. I see the. Uh, I'm see gonna call him right now. He don't know. He don't mm. know I'm calling. Guess what, Rory? We can air this. Mm. Yeah, uh, none of us have said bad things about uh, Yo, Swiss said beats. <laughs> No, but nobody <laughs> said nothing bad about Ari Lennox. I've never I'm said never anything said. bad about Ari Lennox. Uh, yeah, nobody's done never. that. Nobody's done I never that. would. I love, well, I I love her music. Yeah, I've never said but anything But it wasn't bad. bad. It. it was, yo, it's a lot going on on the internet. And it's affecting how I hear the music. That's what I said. Well, Like, she should treat I, us. I feel like, like, like Kehlani treated us. Yeah, Kehlani hated us for like a month. Yeah. yeah. And she came back like, yo, it was a lot. And then, and then Rory went in there, cleaned everything up for Joe. Called her up. Got us the interview. Yeah, because I called Atlantic. Like, yo, I think me and Kalani got an issue. Like, I mean, we don't give a fuck with this. <laughs> <laughs> Atlantic didn't care to mend it at all. Shout out to Kalani, friend of the show. We love you. And I saw Ari this uh, this past week. She said hello to everyone. Oh, see? It's all love. Wait, Progress. she did? 
Well, well not it's me. All, it's all love. Not me. Everyone. It's all no. love. Every, I'm ev- wait, I every, think I'm everyone. Everything is love. <laughs> you fall under I think everyone. I'm everyone. You fall yeah. under that, yeah. Everything is love. Yeah. I was surprised. I definitely never spoke bad about Ari Lennox. Really? Everything is love. But, you know, it's all good. We love her. She loves us. I love Ari Lennox. Everyone I'm loves everyone. She didn't say what she called us. Everybody loves everybody. <laughs> Well, sometimes we still have to call. Sometimes family goes through through tiffs. Oh, we're, yeah. fam- we're family. We're all family. Listen, I just found out I'm D- D'Angelo's friend last week. So oh, that's true. <laughs> life is life is on the up and up for me, guys. I don't know what to tell you. I've turned that. Just being honest here. So fast. D'Angelo's my friend. Like, don't fuck y'all. I got friends. You guys were talking. I like to. I like it to sound like there's commotion. Put, put his put his whole name in your zone, mind. zone, zone. <laughs> it's the zone that we own. Oh come on, buddy. Come on, he just sold. Right, he I, just sold I, something I, for I, quarter I, billion. I, you know I, he's spending I, that money right now. Hello. Zone, zone, zone. Yes, sir. Uh, <laughs> listen, this is Joe Button calling from the Joe Button Podcast, which means we are on air, Swiss. How are you? <laughs> I'm uh, good, man. Zone, zone, zone. <laughs> uh, equity, nigga. Uh. Oh, you got. You probably got Alicia by. You can't. You can't. You know I mean, you probably can't they, get in. Yeah, Wifey right there. They, Alicia don't let him say nigga. They said. Like, they, they said. They said he probably got Alicia like now. right there. Yeah, Alicia <laughs> don't let him talk. Hey, so he he said they, you. He laughing hey, right so at you. Seriously, wrong with you? Hey, Swiss. Hey. Yeah. Congratulations. Oh man, thank you. That's 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 all I got. That's not true. I'm reading this. I'm reading something that says Swiss Beats and Timberlands versus has been acquired by Triller Network. Acquired is where I'm stopping at. You sold it. License? Am I asking? I'm doing too much. You can tell me. <laughs> yes, I mean you know, um, yeah, it's, it's it is. It's sold. Oh, they got a big bag. Mm. Oh, it's yo. sold, but it's not. But but you know. You know, that's not that's not necessarily a bad thing. Like, you know, like, you know, um, that big bag. It's, 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 a, it's a good thing because now uh, we're rich. Man, enjoy the mountains. Hey, Swiss, no. just, just enjoy the mountains with your wife, man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, just, I shot you want to talk yeah, to us. We know what time it is, man. Yeah. <laughs> that's that's look, awesome. we, we, we own we, we owners and trust them now, right? So versus Triller, so. You know, it's sold, but we still there. We still, we 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 owners in the overall shit now, which which is which is fresh, man. Well, Swiss, like we just said about uh, we just said this about the whole square title uh acquiring last week. You mm-hmm. you 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 would sell title uh when you're allowed to participate in other ways, and what it sounds like is that that's what happened here. You sold versus, and now you're allowed to participate. In some other ways with Trilla, correct? Correct. Awesome. And with and and with verses, by the way. Awesome. Right? Awesome. Awesome. Congrats. Oh shit. Mm. Took the little thing of a jiggy out. Nah, that is awesome. Friends with us, you know. Wait, what'd you say? I said, and we got to bring all our friends with us. That's my favorite part of this whole deal. Yeah. 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 Every artist that's that my favorite. Build that's my favorite part gets too. Equity in it. That, mm-hmm. That's amazing. Yeah, that's that's my favorite part too. Dope. Listen, listen. I, I I know what type of time Triller is on, cause when 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 we were free agents, we got on the phone with Triller and they were very aggressive speaking to us as well, and it, it scared me. They they told me to, they told me to name my price, and I hung up. So I'm, I'm, I'm imagining that he said the same thing to you, and you didn't hang up. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm thinking you named a number and it got done. You don't have to answer that. But this is awesome. Uh, I think this is the future of the way deals are being done uh, yeah. with equity and just participation. Yeah. Uh, and you have to include artists now. So I, I personally want to yes. thank you and say I appreciate the way that y'all did this, molded this, and presented this because I think it's going to do a lot for the future. Yeah, it's great. Thank you. Yes, I think it's important, you know, because we build so many platforms and, you know, the creatives are never really – going to the IPOs and, and going public, you know, we're always left out of those things. So, mm-hmm. you know, it was it was our job to make sure that, you know, everybody can go together with the IPO and, you know, with the ownership. And, you know, they only used to seeing like a few of us doing these things. They're not used to seeing over 40 some people moving as a as a unit together in an ownership way. 
Mm. And, you know, for me, I think that that's my favorite part <clears throat> of the whole thing um, is that we was able to bring the community with us to another level, you know, and it's like, uh, and, and, you know, the crazy part is like the artists would have still been happy for us if, if we didn't include of them. Of course. They would have still been happy for us because everybody had fun. But it's just like, okay, why don't we just go on the whole ride together, you know? And and that's just, that's the way how that's that's the way how we want other people to treat us, you know. We want respect from each other, but we don't respect each other. We want ownership, but right. we don't give ownership to each other, right. right? So that's what me and Tim wanted to like push push a little bit further and show people that listen, everybody can eat. Right. You see what I'm saying? Like it don't have to just be me and Tim holding up the flag. Like we've seen the story already, mm -hmm. you know. Like let everybody participate. You know, getting this news on a Tuesday that they ownership and they, that they have ownership in the company that they felt that they got paid from already, whether it was from streams, whether it was from merchandise, right. whether it was from, you know, all type of things. You know, and we feel that we people shouldn't have to fight for everything. Like we got to fight for everything. You know, it's just like we shouldn't. You know, like we should just do great things. And right. so this was this was important for us. And Triller was uh, the only place that was allowing us to have the artist freedom to do what we did. Everybody else, it wasn't, they didn't, you know, it, it didn't work. And it's cool. All of that shit is super inspirational. Let me get messy for two seconds. Uh, <laughs> Larry Jackson called me this morning. I got his thoughts off of the record about Zodiac signs. Nothing to do with verses. <laughs> now, what I will say is this. When we did our Spotify deal and... As, as I try to negotiate different deals, one of the roadblocks I run up against is when the, when the deal ends, the companies try to get us to not be able to sign a new deal or promote a new deal for at least six months, maybe a year after that deal is done. D'Angelo just happened a week ago, and y'all yeah. have announced a deal. Yeah. When you hang up, because I don't want to incriminate you at all in this, I'm going to ask my viewing audience... How Apple could have let that happen? <laughs> that's it. At well, that <laughs> you don't have to say nothing. <laughs> that's just confusing to me. Like I would have never let y'all be able to sign a deal and announce a deal a week after our deal has come to an end. Are you kidding me? Yeah, well, that's you know, Apple didn't Apple didn't own us, you know. Um, but even in a, even been... in a license. <laughs> Listen, man, tell Alicia we love her. <laughs> we love you. Listen, enjoy. enjoy. Zone, zone, zone. Wait, 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 wait. Look, I want to give much love to Larry Jackson, yeah, much no, love to much Apple. Love. Always got you know what I'm saying? Like, 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 <laughs> gotta give much okay. love. It's okay. Yeah. It's okay. You know, we, 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 got, we got super love for, for, for Larry Jackson for many years. You know, um, Same. thank Shout you. For, thank you for Apple. For supporting us, and you know, sky's not the limits. It's just a view. Let's go. Zone. My last question: What do you say to the people that may think that you guys have run out of matchups? Tell them to put some new ones on the table in front of us. Tell them. Tell them to look. Uh, tell them to look at Instagram tomorrow. Mm. Uh oh. Uh oh. Okay. Uh -oh. Okay. Uh -oh. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Yeah. All right, cool. Listen, Swiss, we love you again. Congratulations. Really great things you're doing. Send uh send our our, our send the same to Timbaland for us, please. Yeah. Absolutely. Absolutely. And we appreciate the support. You know what I'm saying? And Joe, you know what it is. Zone, zone, zone. Yes, sir. We'll talk soon, man. Love. All right, love. No, that's dope. I I well, re really love that he really that's how you really brought it. That's it. That's how you do it. That's how you do it. So now back to well, back I to mean, this. Has yes, been. he sold it, but he also has equity in the company that bought it. Yeah. So it's not like it really went away. From yeah. ownership. And I'm pretty sure they still have creative control and, mm -hmm. you know. Trailer seems like a, a very intelligent company, and I doubt they would want to take that away from Swizz and Tim as far as the creative no. shit with Versus. Like, no, no y'all have killed this shit. Yeah. You guys should continue to run it. Yeah. We just want y'all to bring that platform and that audience here. Mm-hmm. Back to the pitchfork we read now that we understand this a little better. Swiss and Timberland's Versus has been acquired by Triller Network, the parent company of the TikTok competitor Triller. 
While the exact nature of the deal was undisclosed, it was announced that the two versus founders are now larger shareholders in the Triller Network and that they have allocated a portion of their equity in the Triller versus combined company to all 43 creatives who have performed on versus to date. I think that is so swaggy. No, it's amazing. That is so even if it's the tiniest, tiniest, tiniest bit, it's the gesture. Mm -hmm. Wow. And from Triller's perspective, too, I want to give them credit because I could totally see a company looking at Swizz and Tim and going, no. 100%. <laughs> Happens every day, I think. No fucking way. We'll give y'all some equity. No, I think I'm going to do it with all 43 of these artists. Fuck you. <laughs> I think what it is is these platforms are starting to see that, you know, we'll always find a way to create. Some of them, yeah. Yeah, you know what I mean? And if it's, it's either you want to, it's a partnership now or we're going to continue to do what we do over here. Mm -hmm. And y'all continue to do what y'all do. But it just makes sense for Versus to say, listen, we we, we know the audience that y'all have acquired. We've seen the numbers. We've seen what y'all do. Like, we want to be a part of it mm -hmm. in some way. And this, they this made this happen. The, 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 the two things that I will say about this, I'm not privy to, I'm not privy to any more business than some of you are out there, some of the viewers. Uh, but like, yeah, like I said to Swiss, that was a mistake. Like not having that clause in a contract, not having any clause in a contract that prohibits them from Keisha Cole and the Shanti not on it. That's what I just said. I was just reading it. D'Angelo's on that's there a, twice, so typo. I can see that's this a being typo. a typo. Oh. that's oh, okay. a typo because okay. Swiss may, let it uh, let it be known. Okay. Anyone who has participated, <laughs> yeah. is they, getting they, equity. They left them off. Yeah, so that's just a typo. But yeah, for them to be able to announce that deal a week after the D'Angelo shit, right? Mm -hmm. My brain tells me you had to negotiate it. Like when you're talking equity, it takes a while, mm -hmm. and when you're talking about Sorry. equity for everybody, hell yeah, whoa, it takes even longer. So let's put ninety days yeah. on it. Yeah. 90 days is it's a, a short quick, it's short it's quick <laughs> I know but I'm trying to do it in relation to the 10 episode license that I assume Apple to have had I didn't go back and check to see what Apple put out mm -hmm. but I'm thinking it's a 10, 10 episode order Wait, or something like that on. was D'Angelo the 10th yeah it all makes sense to me now what part <laughs> why we were all sitting here alright why wouldn't you postpone why wouldn't you postpone it was going to be D'Angelo and Maxwell on Valentine's Day. Cool. If it doesn't happen on Valentine's Day, we still want to see D'Angelo and Maxwell. And Maxwell at some And then point. Maxwell is trying to figure this shit out. And then all of a sudden we get something that has nothing to do with the structure of this platform at all. It's just D'Angelo. It's a D'Angelo concert. And it's a versus. I'm getting out my deal. It's not a versus. We're getting out the deal. I'm getting out my deal. Yeah, we spoke about this. We're getting we out the deal because yeah. we have to start the next deal that we finished. Yeah. yeah. Damn, but now Maxwell don't get that. You know what I mean? I was forget say, about yeah, that, you know. but y'all didn't tell... Nobody told Larry Jackson. I'm assuming. I'm assuming. Nobody spoke that to Apple and said, hey, we got this deal done in like week five of that. Yeah. <laughs> like we're finished. It's just interesting. Do you have to? Yeah. I don't think you do. It would what's, what's your question? Huh? I don't think what's, you what's your exact did. question? I'm sorry. Did, what, did Swizz and Tim have to tell Larry that they were talking to Triller? No. Oh, that's how I feel. If we have a 10 episode they, deal and I want to start negotiating something else after and I'm going to fulfill my 10 episodes, I'll tell you a fucking thing. You know, you Unless I want to continue to work with you. Mm -hmm. You don't have to. You're right. But it looks away if you don't. Business. Yeah. Well, here's the thing. I think you only. Not only does it look away if you don't. I'm sorry, Roy. Not only does it look away if you don't. But just in the in the art of negotiating and leverage. No, no, no. But you can't say that because you agree with. Khaled not telling Ace Hood about that deal for We the Best, so you can't you can't say no. That. I said he was within his right, but I would have if I if I planned on Cal, uh, Ace Hood continuing with me as my flagship artist, and I would have done that because Ace Hood delivers to me absolutely. Definitely but is. if we're dealing with just rights, no, Khaled didn't have to tell him, and they didn't have to tell him. I'm just saying, like, what type of deal did did Apple? And again, speculation here. Yeah, what type of deal did Apple present? Where the relationship maybe no equity, maybe with, no equity to the other artists. That's that's my point in saying if they went to Triller, let's for example, episode five, it means Apple was not delivering what they wanted. And if 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 Swiss and Tim walked away from Apple because they did not agree to give equity to the artists that performed already, I love them. Then I'm highlighting I love this. I'm highlighting more. this even more because yeah, you can't tell me that yeah. Apple didn't offer them a bag. Right. Well, hold on. Apple Let's, offered them a licensing bag. For sure. I'm not, I can I can feel <laughs> safe to guess that. Yeah. I'm not here to stick up for Apple. 
but I'm going to. That's different with Triller and Apple. It's way more difficult to go to Apple and say, I want equity of course. with everything for all 43 artists to Apple the way you could with Triller. Way, 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 way oh. fucking different. There sure. could be stock yeah, options. But it doesn't, but it doesn't have to be. Yeah, there could be stock I'm just You're saying, right. I'm just saying. But it doesn't have different. to be. Apple, could, Apple could go make a fucking split company. Mm-hmm. Sure. Sure. And offer them equity in this new split company. Yeah. Apple has no problem doing that, but they but, didn't. But also, so we I don't know if Apple actively has this lane the way Triller does of us wanting to do a lot of live content, a lot of things that are internet-based and artist-based the way Apple just doesn't at the moment. I'm not saying they couldn't do it. But, but it's, it's easier to start a, a side company if you're Apple and that's what you want to focus on and be a competitor to Triller with the live event shit. Then you could give equity to every artist. If you don't have that, were you going to give equity and Apple to somebody? It's but, not going to happen. But in this negotiating shit, right? Like, I saw niggas kill me with the Patreon shit. I saw niggas kill Hove with the uh, square, square. Mm. with the square shit. Build you up to break you down. In this Build type you up of, again. It's like, Joe, we need you back so we could kill your ass again. That's been my whole career. <laughs> <laughs> they, on, they only want me so they could kill me. I'm clear on that. I should have made a cool line out of it, too. <laughs> That's where you fucked up. That's cool. I, I never made cool lines. Um, you did. You did. Joe, Joe's cool lines. line was fuck y'all. <laughs> and fuck these niggas. But, <laughs> but like public perception sometimes, I'll use me for example. They kill me with the Patreon shit. Who cares about Ego. Patreon? We don't care about that. We don't care about that. It's corny, it's corny, it's corny, right? But mm-hmm. as the person that's negotiating, you want to go to somewhere that has a large upside versus like Apple, like Rory is saying. Like Apple's Apple. Mm-hmm. If they don't want to create the, the, the new company and break you down, then cool, but Triller now. This is what's so dope oh. about these type of companies wow. that, that aren't running the whole fucking world the way Apple is. Mm. You have more room to maneuver with these type of companies. Yeah. It's way, way different. Apple is making fucking hardware. Mm-hmm. Think they care about Keisha Cole and Ashanti getting equity? <laughs> and if they're going to continue down this path, Triller, I'm saying now, uh, I like what they're they do. They have content. They have uh, they like have a two chain show. They announced some Mike Tyson shit. The, the the Jake Paul shit. I loved way more than I anticipated. Do they have battle rap? I love oh, the Mike Tyson. Caffeine. That's caffeine. That's still caffeine. That's caffeine. Okay. Uh, they I can see them moving in. They that announced space, some yeah, Snoop right. Dogg shit. Listen, if if caffeine don't do right by the battle rappers, what what is to stop the battle rappers from going to do the same shit? I haven't uh, loved that Triller. platform for what it's worth. Totally. Caffeine. See. Yeah. Triller. Triller. Yeah. Caffeine. Y'all gotta do the right thing. Caffeine, I like. I like what they. The it, idea it is great. To, the I idea don't is like amazing. nothing if they're not gonna pay the battle rappers. Oh no, no, that's first and foremost. We ain't even got to. This same shit that Swiss just, just did is what caffeine needs to do with the battle rappers. Agreed. Hey, we busting this well down. Deserved. Some of y'all on equity here, and and now y'all can participate. I agree. As we rise, they should do that. Absolutely. But I'm not gonna make niggas do the right thing if the battle rappers are still popping up happy with battling on caffeine. Hey, my nigga, have a blast. Right. Like right. whatever works for you. I don't want to. That's my new shit. I'm not. I'm not killing somebody because they didn't do what Joe thinks they should have did. Mm-hmm. Whatever works. Right. But I do think that there's a way for the battle rappers to participate the same way the versus participants are participating. Oh, for sure, because there are battle rappers that should have equity in whatever platforms that those battles are being. Housed I, at. I just don't think that caffeine is doing a good job with like marketing the shit. Honestly, I. I I'm the last person to know when a battle rap when event is happening. happening. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm with Parks yeah. all the way on that. Yeah. I'm a battle rap fan. Uh, let, me, let me provide some pushback, though. Remember, sure. I, remember I texted you and asked you how to use the fucking app? Yeah. <laughs> I was like, wait, how do I get to this battle? Hop sent me a link. He just sent me a link like, yo, here's. Right. I was like, okay, cool. Click. Yeah, but I'm. Are, are we certain that Caffeine has even thought about uh, mass promotion as opposed to would, just worrying about the people that have downloaded the app and we're focused on in-app only. We haven't moved to outside you of app. You should be promoting I'm, I'm admitted, so people can download that. You I'm an admitted casual fan. And unfortunately, you make when you want to get to the next level, the casual fan is where you're going to make your money and get you the next tier. I'm a casual fan. If I can't find that shit, I'm not. It's not. If you can't, it always true. goes back to that. If you can't find it, you we don't have, know what's we happening. We have X amount of people subscribing to us on Patreon. We are making X amount of dollars. And let me tell you from my mouth, I don't give a fuck if anybody casual else tunes in. The uh, people that are there right now. You're, mis- you're misunderstanding what oh, I'm saying. Go ahead. Um, I'm not saying from a monetary value. Yes, I think we've had this core 
fan base conversation a thousand times. So mm-hmm. it's not, we're not going to rehash of it. Of course. Getting to the next level of... We always rehash things here. Go ahead. Do. <laughs> do you think it's easier to get on caffeine now or back in the day? Yo, you think it's easy to <laughs> get caffeine now? Back in the day. I don't know, man. Yeah. It was easy to have, get caffeine uh, back in the day. <laughs> uh, as, as far as ex- exposure and eyes on your app, which will eventually lead to monetary value, yeah, you have to get to that next tier where the casual fan knows about what's going on. Yes, you can maybe make more money just focusing on your core fan base in theory, but if you want to get to that next next level, you need the masses to know about it. And oh, that no. comes from promotion. But what, and I feel like caffeine, to Parks' point, I completely agree with him, doesn't do a good job of it. <laughs> you're right. My response to that is I don't think everyone cares about what you're saying. True. I don't think everyone cares about the getting to the next level. Mm-hmm. I think caffeine is treating it like if you know, you know type of thing. Yeah. No, that, that's that's totally fair. Let's take it back to our Pusha T Spotify interview. I don't want to bore the listeners again with this shit. We did over 2 million listeners on the Pusha T episode. Mm-hmm. Give me any number of that that y'all think. Subscribe to Spotify from that one interview alone. Not many. What's, it not, was, uh, what's not many? Give me. The people that listened to that episode that for episode. the first time and then subscribe to Spotify? Yeah. Two million, I'd say maybe, maybe f- less than five percent of that. Which is what? I, none, I don't think any of us can do math in this maybe room. 40, <laughs> maybe forty. Maybe uh, forty thousand. Someone, which is a lot. Don't bring up a calculator. Let's all save yeah, ourselves. That's why I'm confused. <laughs> I know I'm pulling up a calculator right now. Yeah, that's not. A, it's not bad actually. If you think about it, if thirty thousand people subscribe. Do you know how to do that? After that, I'm not mad at that. Well, that's not what I'm doing. I'm doing y'all talk thirty. It's a lot of money for yeah. one three-hour piece of content. Absolutely. Well, here, here's that, a th- that's your low end. That's your low end. You said thirty thousand, and I multiplied with what Spotify averages a new subscription to be. Okay. Bong. Mm-hmm. Bong. And you're saying that that's this the, is your, that's this the money is, value. This is off your low thirty thousand number. I would have it higher than that. Okay. So now, if I'm Triller, right? These are the numbers I'm focused. If I, if I'm not doing what Rory's saying. Mm. If I'm not trying to mass promote and get more people and get to that next level, like if I'm cool with just this number and uh-huh. just these people, then I'm cool. But to that That's back to my point that everybody can't go. Like we're getting we're getting to the spot where this is a niche thing. Yeah. This is a luxury thing. This is not for mass consumption in the future, I don't think. Agree. Everything isn't. Yeah. Uh, I especially with this type well, of content, I agree. They're picking teams now. Mm-hmm. They already got the captains and they're picking the teams now. So nothing about that's Joe's opinion, by the way. I don't mm. nothing about them picking teams now. Fucking Amazon picked coming to America, Eddie Murphy. Mm-hmm. Everybody's picking their content. Like yeah. uh-huh. if, they, if that's happening in 2021, what do I think the future of this looks mm. like? Mm. And I promise we're not gonna get into one of our best. Yeah, no, we have things. no random no, no <laughs> random. Just, oh, go ahead. Just quickly. Go ahead. No, we're not <laughs> arguing. Just quickly. No, no, no. Now nah, you my man. No, no. Nah, I love you. <laughs> no, nah, I love you, son. No, nah, I, I love, love you, you nigga. Son. <laughs> I love you, son. This is my God. God. Family for <laughs> real. <laughs> uh, off that Pusha T example, to the casual shit, a lot of our Pusha T views were off sensationalism. Mm-hmm. It was off what was Timing being talked about. And that brought in the Gift casual fan that wouldn't typically listen to us and to that number you're saying that percentage of that casual fan that went after the sensationalism Stop got to, got to that number that wasn't a small number i have the that's number what higher I'm, that's what i'm saying about getting the casual fan even if you grasp just a little bit of the casual fan base you're doing numbers man yeah that casual fan base shit do matter well that's why everybody only promotes to their casual to casual fans man. Mm. Because well, they, they need promotion. They need to be promoted to because they're casual. Myself included. I like battle rap, but I'm a casual battle rap fan. I need to be promoted to. I'm not going to sit and research. Yeah. If, if it ain't fucking daylight right now, I'm probably not going to know. Yeah. <laughs> Lux better be on round seven for daylight. <laughs> no, that's going to be crazy. I don't know how many rounds he got written already. But see, if I'm a battle rapper, we're getting off this because I don't know how compelling this is to the audience. But well, it's I'm interesting. A, if I'm a, ba- if just I'm a battle, battle, battle rapper, rapper, not uh. If I'm the best, because that's the position that we operate from. Mm-hmm. We are one of the best podcasts in the world. Mm-hmm. Now, if I move that to podcast, I'm not podcast, uh, battle rap. If I'm Lux or Daylight or one of the best battlers in the world, mm-hmm. I'm not battling anywhere else without an equity conversation. You will never see me again without that talk being had. Mm-hmm. Sorry, mm-hmm. Caffeine. 
You're not getting Daylight versus Lux and Daylight or Lux getting no, 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 no. But the fans hate when I say equity, so that's my last time saying the word, and I'm done. <laughs> it's not. Even it's though, fun. But we just started with this word. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We just got just, here. That's why I hate these niggas, man. We just started getting equity. Some yeah. of these fights we got to have. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Some of the conversations we have to have, I know it's annoying, I know it's redundant, I know it's repetitive, but some of them are necessary. Mm. And as somebody who has over 20 years experience here, this is new. Yeah. Mm. This is new. Sorry that y'all are tired of it, but don't care. This is new. It's too much money going around, and people need to participate in all of it. Correct. All of it. All of it. Damn, I'm not gonna say the name. I was about to say. Damn, you fumbled the bag, my G. Uh, <laughs> this is a stick up coming. These days. <laughs> this is a stick up coming. I, this this shit couldn't look any more beautiful right now. I mean, I don't know how we landed here, but for Joe, this looks beautiful out here. Swiss doing this. Hove doing that. The Ambies and the companies doing this nasty fucking shit right here.